My name is Brother Wilson Sunama. I'm here to return all the glory to the Almighty God who preserved my life. Today, exactly seven days, we were coming back from Kaduna. We have a fatal accident. But I give God the glory. During the accident, all I know, I just find myself going somewhere. Uh, next thing I know, I find I saw an angel through the mantle of this commission. That is our father in the Lord. He said, my son, where are you going to? Go back. Who will take care of your family? Immediately, I return back. Next thing I found myself in a stretcher in the hospital. As I come back, they say I was being in coma for three hours. And uh, immediately, I, I was having bruises. But immediately, the mantle said, come back. All the bruises disappear. They have even announced that I am dead in my village. People start greeting my, my mother. But thank God, I'm alive. Anybody that saw the accident, they couldn't believe uh, that we are the one that come out from the accident. So I return all the glory to God in Jesus' name. Our brother, go on. Our brother was involved in a ghastly motor accident. You are going to see the ruin of the car right now. You see the blood even on the ground right there. So he was in coma for three hours and he said he was departing to an unknown destination. In that course of journey, the senior pastor appeared and said, hold on, where are you going my to? My son, where my, are you going? My son, where are you going to? Who, Who will take, take care, care of, of your, your family? family? Yeah. Go, back. Go back. Go back. He said before that time, he had injuries, every other thing on his body. But when that was declared and he returned back to his body, Everything disappeared and he recovered. Look at, is this part of this? If you look at what is under his eye now, in some cases it might be indications of fractures on the base of his skull. Okay? Terrible, ghastly accident he has had. Out of his body already on the way. But by a prophet, the Lord brought Israel out of Egypt. And by a prophet was he preserved. My son, where are you going? Who will take care of your family? Come back to your body. Look at the family, his wife and children. Who will take care of them? Turn back. And he turned back. And as he woke up in the hospital, all the bruises had disappeared. I'm sure this other one was left to remind him that he had an accident. Who is your father? What mantle is over your life? Who will interrupt your journey? When you are taking a journey that is not correct and taking a journey that is premature, it is very important for this heart-to-heart -heart connection, for God to know, for angels to know, for the demons to know, who can step in and interrupt the agenda of wickedness. But for everybody under this cover, I prophesy to you, every journey organized for you that is not for on your, your time, that journey is arrested. You will not die before your time. You will fulfill your days. You, your brothers, your relations, Everyone connected, associated, related with you, they shall fulfill their days. If you believe that, say the loudest amen. And tell the person next to you, tell them you shall fulfill your days. And then you might be seated in the presence of the Lord.